What's up you guys, it's Cody coming back at you with another video and you guys read the title, you already know what this is about. I've talked to you guys about this, but for those of you that are new, we will be comparing the sound of my straight pipe with and without the eight inch tip on it. Okay, so as you can see, we got a huge eight inch tip on the end of our uh, five inch straight pipe. Now, for those of you guys that are new, this truck has an aftermarket intake, a KC300 turbo uh, that we just put in the last video, exhaust, back pressure, delete pedestal, all new intercooler boots, new up pipes, uh, the five inch straight pipe, and that tip is eight inch tip. And we have the Hydra tuner on it and we're running 140 horsepower tune. So those are all the upgrades that we have on this truck that's gonna affect how the exhaust sounds and stuff like that. So again, I will be doing various different testing, uh, different ways to test the sound of the exhaust with and without the tip, you know, a startup, uh, revving it up, taking off, driving by, driving between buildings, and I'll do each of those things with and without a tip. You guys can compare the sound. Uh, I'm telling you guys right now, if you have never really seen anything like this or know about this, I think you're gonna be very surprised at how much of a difference the tip makes. Adding that tip really eliminates a lot of turbo whistle, but you get a much deeper, more aggressive sounding truck. I think with that tip, my 7.3 sounds uh, much more like a 6.0, much more aggressive and deep sounding. If I take that tip off, the turbo whistle is insane, so much louder. You guys will see, this shouldn't be a very long video, so I won't talk too much. Let's just go ahead and pretty much get on into it real quick before we do. At the end of all this, at the end of this video, when you've heard how the truck sounds with and without the exhaust tip, I want you guys to tell me your opinion on what you think sounds better with the tip or without the tip. Now, as I've kind of mentioned to you guys before, if we all kind of agree that it sounds better without the tip, what I wanna do is actually take this, old piece of the straight pipe or leftover piece of the straight pipe cut it to size and i'm gonna weld it on the end of my straight pipe i'm gonna take the tip off and weld it on and cut it to where it's just about the end of the tip but you still can't see it so the straight pipe will come all the way to the end so the tip will still be there for looks but it'll basically be just a five inch straight pipe out the back and it'll have all that turbo whistle if you guys agree if we all agree that it sounds better without the tip but the tip can still be there if you guys think it sounds better with the tip i'll leave the tip on let me know what you guys think at the end and also at the end i will be announcing the winner of the no half fast merchandise giveaway that we started in the kc300 turbo install video so stick around for that make sure you guys subscribe if you're not already subscribed to share this video with some friends and let's go ahead and get on into it
Right, so there you guys have it the testing is all done uh, sorry this video was kind of short I wish I could have got more clips for you but we actually just got a new puppy we drove 18 hours round trip in one day to go get him he'll probably be featured in a future video we got a little boy Dogo Argentino like I said we'll feature him in another video let's get back into this I kind of listened to the clips and you guys can hear the difference for sure in the video at least i think so hopefully you guys can pick it up but you definitely can tell the difference a lot more in person you know when i was driving and in the truck i could hear the difference way more than you can on video but hopefully you guys are still able to pick it up now originally i thought that i liked that turbo whistle sound a lot more i do i do like the turbo whistle i miss the turbo whistle but all in all especially at high rpms I actually now realized now that I took the tip off that I prefer that deep roaring aggressive sound that that tip makes when it's at really high RPMs. Like I said to me, it sounds a little more like a 6.0, still not as good as a, as a good built 6.0 with a nice exhaust system, but it does kind of sound more aggressive and more beastly with that tip on there. So I thought I was going to like it more without it, but I think I like it with it. All in all, the turbo whistle is cool, but I like that aggressive sound. Tell me what you guys think. Uh, should I just throw the tip back on and run it with the tip like you guys heard in the videos and the comparisons or should I weld that extension on there and then slip the tip all the way over the extension so we have a straight five inch all the way back with all that turbo whistle so tell me what you guys think other than that hope you guys enjoyed the video again sorry it was a little short and uh, let's go ahead and announce the winner to the giveaway and you guys killed it in the last video in the case of 300 turbo video I told you guys if you get that video to 125 likes before we announce the winner the winner would get a hat and a decal and you guys killed it we got way more than 125 likes so that is the case the winner will be receiving a hat of their choice and a decal of their choice okay so again what you guys can do if you want to see more information is go to nohatfastapparel.com and you can see the different hats and uh, decals that we have and the winner can tell me what they want so let's go ahead and pull up the uh, random comment giveaway website and uh, see who won All right, so there you guys have it, Bud, and then I'm just gonna say Bud F, so that way I don't slaughter your last name, no offense, but Bud F, you are our winner of our No Half Ass Apparel Merchandise Giveaway. So again, we have two different types of hat. This is a navy blue trucker hat, so it's a foam front vinyl pressed No Half Ass uh, decal on it, snap back, net back, and uh, there's one option of our hats. The other hat is a black one. It's actually, this is my personal one black and it's embroidered instead of the vinyl press also a snapback netback but yeah this is a this is a cloth cloth and and uh embroidered instead of the vinyl press so two different types you can pick the one you want out of one of those and then of course we have the two different style decals we have the no half ass decal with the dollar signs on the end and the regular no half ass decal so you can pick one of those, or you can pick the large no half ass decal, which is on the back of my truck. All right, other than that, thank you everybody that entered. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you stick around for future ones, so that way you can enter in the next giveaways, because we will be doing more. Uh, hit that subscribe button if you're not already subscribed. Like this video if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment down below, as I asked earlier. Check out nofastpro.com, and I'll catch you guys on the next video.